A lot of the strongest commanders in the format are build around commanders. But here are five commanders you can pretty much build however you want, Queen Marchessa. By introducing the monarchy, Queen Marchessa is a card advantage engine on a stick. And with her death touch haste token, she's great at getting it back. You can make this a political deck, a spot removal deck, or any kind of deck you really want. And because she's a card advantage engine, she's gonna make it work. Zyra the Golden Sting. This is another commander that overall is just very strong. The only thing you want to make sure this deck has is some removal so that you can make sure you're popping those eggs, getting those creatures, and drawing cards. Asika, God of the Tree. Now, nobody plays the front side of this card. Everyone plays the back side of this card, the Prismatic Bridge. And this thing treats Planeswalkers and Creatures into play. So this deck says, play Planeswalkers or play Creatures. That's a ton of decks. You can do whatever you want with this commander. Tox will ask nothing of you. He will run away with the game as long as he stays on the board for a turn or two. You can make a blue-black good stuff deck, or you can make a blue-black bug deck with slugs and snakes and stuff like that. Either way, Tox is going to be disgusting. Maelstrom Wanderer. All he says is cast him and get value. You can just play whatever deck around this, and then once you get to him, he's going to cascade into two cards for some awesome card advantage.